what is a sustainable green life? Less waste? Turn off the lights? Climb more trees? I don't know, but I will find out. My name is Emmy. I'm writing an article for my school's newspaper about green living. Do you make them all here? Yes, I prepare the clay here and then I fire it over there. These are beautiful. Yeah, they are the zero carbon ceramics and I wish to have an exhibition for them someday. So you get to do all of this at home? Actually, I used to rent a studio outside. When we got the PV system, I found out that it was more green and more sustainable to do it at home. It must consume a lot of energy, right? Yes, but with this system, I can fire the ceramics even into late night with stored electricity. How did you find out about the system? That was my friend Elias. I'm actually go going to his place right now, and he's almost an expert on green living. Do you want to come? Yeah, I would love to. I'll just prepare here and we can meet outside. Yeah. Is this your EV charger? Yes, we recently bought it. Although it came later than the PV system, it adapts really well. Come on, let's go. So about your, your article, how long is it? Well, it's about one page. Is it hard to find information? Hey. hey. Ja, ah, toppen. Tack så mycket. Det här är Emmy. Hon skriver en skoluppsätt som hållbar ah. Så jag tänkte att ni kunde, du kunde berätta lite för henne. Sure, come on in. Hi, I'm Emmy. Well, what does green living mean to you? Well, actually, you're looking at it. So this is my garage where I have my inverter and my two batteries. Over here is my basil plants and the chili plants. Over there is uh, run by the sun. So all your food you consume is carbon free? Well, maybe not everything, but uh, that's the goal for me and my family. In the future, I'm, I'm planning to get more batteries and uh, maybe have a big greenhouse outside uh, where I can grow my own vegetables and uh, share with my friends and family. But with all of these batteries, isn't it complicated? No, actually it's not. I just have to call my installer, so for me it's just a phone call. Can you do this all the time? Yeah, even during winter time, the batteries are awesome. That's so fun. Well, speaking of fun, you should go see Bo. He's my neighbor. He takes a greenhouse living to a next level. Wow. Hi, you must be Emmy. How did you know? Elias called me and told me you were coming. What do you want to know? Well, Elias told me you're all about green living. How is this eco-friendly? Oh, the whole building is solar powered. That's a solar-powered car? No, that's a normal racing car, but uh, I'm thinking of a solar racing car in the future, because that is the trend now. Let me show you something at the back. Wow, so many trophies. How long have you been racing for? I've been racing for 53 years now, and uh, I did oh. a race last weekend with the car down there. Well, since you've been racing for so long, isn't safety very important? Oh, safety is always priority one. So that is why I'm so fond of over this battery package. It's totally safe. Well, with all your accomplishments yeah. and all of these trophies, what are you planning on doing next? Come on, I'll show you. Oh, I'm planning to stay here in the nature with my dogs and uh, in a couple of years I will probably stop racing because I'm getting too old and I'm also going to invest in uh, one more battery in my PV system and then I'm helping the neighbors here to get solar panels because they see that my system works and that they all want to have the same. Hi, may I help you? You also have the PV system? Yeah, we were actually the first in town to get it. That's so cool. Tell me more. Of course. Come. 
Det är så. Pappa, men när vill veta mer om PV-systemet? Hej. Hello. Hej. Jakob. Thank you. Hello Isa, kan du sätta den i frysen? Uh, what do you want to know? So, this one's for the weather. Yes. What's that one for? Uh, this shows my PV system. I get up in the morning uh, and I look at the screens and they really help me have control of my life and my house. This is my daughter Louisa. I call her plus kid because uh, she was really young when we got the PV system. So every day she looks at the screens and she knows all about green energy. And I think that green energy will be the new norm for your generation. We started out as the first one. People kept asking about the system. Then there was the second, the third. Now there are so many. Today I met the ceramic, the greenhouse owner, racer and the first PV tribe. Gnesta is so different. They're all connected by the green power. From one home to more homes. It's a community that always shines.